In this video, we'll find the oxidation numbers for the manganese here in K2MnO4, potassium manganate. Note this is different than KMnO4, potassium permanganate. We're looking at the potassium manganate, K2MnO4. People often get those two confused. So to do this, we know that there's no negative or positive sign after the K2MnO4. So it's a neutral compound. All the oxidation numbers, they add up to zero. We know potassium, that's in group one on the periodic table, so that'll have a plus one. So each potassium is plus one. The manganese, we don't know that. It's a transition metal, so it can have different oxidation states. We have to look at what it's bonded to to figure out its oxidation number. So for now, let's just call it X. Oxygen is minus two with a few minor exceptions. So we have minus two as our oxidation number on each oxygen atom. So now we can solve for X because we know everything is going to add up to zero. We could say two potassium atoms, each one has a one plus oxidation number, plus, we don't know the manganese, X plus four times minus two, we have four oxygen atoms, each one's minus two, all that equals zero. So we have X, we have minus eight and plus two, so minus six equals zero, add six to both sides, X equals a positive six. So the oxidation number on the MN in the K2MnO4, that's going to be plus six. If we add all these up, four times minus two, that's minus eight plus six minus two, and then two times positive ones plus two, minus two and plus two, it all adds up to zero. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.